Hello, welcome to Myth Monday number five. Myth Monday number five is... Five, five, five. Wow, that was incredible. I know. I don't even think we need to edit it now. I Probably not. But no no post-production <laughs> stuff at all. No. Uh, Myth Monday number five, I'm going to give you a bit of a story. Pam's mm -hmm. been doing some open houses lately. Yeah, which is very exciting because I'm finally allowed and and she's great. quite the social butterfly so she <laughs> loves talking to people she has a hard, hard time with some of the COVID restrictions i struggle anywho uh there's been uh there's been more than one person who has asked her if we are brother and sister yeah they'll have a look at our business card and say oh eric and pam galt brother and sister and that's our myth uh that is a myth <laughs> we are not brother and sister uh all, all <laughs> uh, <laughs> There's a couple of boys, uh, our children, that uh, that don't have webbed fingers or toes, and they uh, they would tell you that we're not brother and sister. Yeah, and in fact, one of the prerequisites of me actually getting married to Eric was that he wasn't family, mm. and so that yeah, I felt like was. Yeah, she's of Mennonite descent, so she's related to nearly everyone. It's so very she, close. She needed to find a non-Mennonite person to marry, and yeah. I and was Wolf and Brung, so you know. I was that I was that person who <laughs> was not. <laughs> and yeah, that's good. I think that's a good thing. Yeah. So anyways. So the myth is, are Eric and Pam, I suppose that's sister. the question. The myth is Eric and Pam Galt are brother and sister, mm. which is Don't not perpetuate the case. that. No, that's a myth. And, that's false. And very busted. And I'm going to just stay very family friendly about all the comments that I could make, but I'm thinking of a few and I'm just going to leave them alone. <laughs> uh, anyways, myth busted. Talk to you next week. <laughs>